you guys, it's Deanna from Pro Life Utah. I am wanting to give you guys some ideas on how to prepare for the March for Life coming up on January 30th, 2021. It'll be at 11 a.m. starting at the Utah State Capitol. So we are having a car parade this year due to COVID. And so for a car parade, we don't want to look like traffic. We want to look like a parade. So I'm hoping to help you guys feel empowered to decorate your vehicles. So I wanted to start out with a truck. So trucks are super easy and if you own one, definitely drive that to the parade. So if you want to decorate a truck, um, there's a couple easy ways to do it. So you can see that we have, oops, that we have a three by five flag right here. If you want to make a flagpole, you can do it for about a dollar fifty. So this is just three quarter inch PVC, um, use three quarter, half inch is too wobbly in the wind and one inch will not fit into these awesome little holes that your truck has. Okay, so use a three quarter inch PVC. You're gonna to want to be at least five or six feet long. And you're gonna to wanna to drill um, a hole straight way through, um, about 33 inches apart. So starting at the top and then 33 inches down, you're gonna drill a hole just straight through the pipe. And you can do two things. So we have these with some wire through them, but you can just straight zip tie your flag through those holes in your, in your flagpole. So the great thing about a truck is that they have these holes. And if my truck didn't have that um, box right there, I would have two sets of these holes in my truck and I could actually put four flags on this truck bed. So what happens is you're gonna take your three quarter inch uh, PVC and if you angle it, you can see that it, I have to find the right spot a little bit. If you angle it in, hold on, it will slide right down. And if I push these down till they're firm, they will not come out. We will be going about 35 um, miles per hour, maybe 45. So this truck has had flags like this on the back and we've done about 55 on the freeway before. So when you guys come to the parade, don't come with your flags on. Just come and then when you get there during setup, we will set up your, uh, you can set up your flags. So the other thing that we'll have available, not as many, but we'll have some of these little guys available. They will be printed on. Um, these are really easy. They just roll up in your window. So another thing that you can do in any type of vehicle is to have a family member or a friend that's in the vehicle and not driving um, hold the pole as you drive. So this is really easy. We've had our kids um, help us with that. They need to be maybe nine or 10 um, or older. And so you're gonna wanna turn your heater on because it is gonna be January and blast the heat. And then this is a really great way to um, have as many flags as you want hanging out of your car. So another idea I wanna give you guys is um, the possibility of decorating your own flags. So we don't know exactly how many of you are gonna to come to the march. So we will have um, about 600 flags between the two different sizes for sale and those are going to be a fundraiser for our mobile ultrasound van. So we would love to sell those to you. Um, I'm hoping though to get over a thousand cars at the march. So if you would like, you can go to some place like Colonial Flag. They have blank flags that are just different colors that you can um, draw on or decorate. So this is one that my son did really quickly with a fat Sharpie marker. Um, and Colonial Flag sells those for about $12.95 and they have some in stock. So that's another idea. The more flags you have, the more high decor that you have, the more like a parade we will look. Okay, so here's some ideas on how to put flags on your car. So again, we also, it's easy to put these window flags in and we will have a couple hundred of those for sale. You can also use their three by five flag on your PVC flagpole, um, which we will have a few of those for sale um, out, out the windows. So that makes it nice and high, right? Cause you can get some height on those flags. The other fun thing with cars that's easy to do is to take a flag and put some carabiners in the grommets. And then you're gonna thread those underneath the lid of your trunk. And you just pull them down. And then you can shut your trunk. 
and this works great it flies out in the wind and it's kind of another fun way to add a flag to your car. Here's some ideas on how to put flags on an SUV. So of course we've got the window flags if you those are available those are very easy. Um, the big flags are more visual and you can of course have somebody holding these on a PVC flag pole out the window and then if you take a look at um, maybe what you have around the house um, or what you sometimes attach to your car, right? So this is a seven bike bike rack that my husband and I have. And um, I saw somebody with the exact same bike rack um, at one of the trains that I, I participated in in the fall and they had three or four flags attached to this bike rack and it was beautiful and fun and gorgeous. So this is an idea. Another idea is a roof rack. So kind of like how we um, put the flag onto the car in the trunk, you know, it's easy to clip a flag onto a roof rack of an SUV. So we are super excited for the March, January 30th, 2021 starting at the Utah State Capitol at 11 a.m. It's gonna be a car parade. We're so excited for you to come. If you have um, any questions, go to our website, marchforlifeutah.org. Um, it's got all the information there. We also have an event on our Facebook page. You can message us with any questions or DM us on Instagram. Also, don't forget that you are able to um, purchase blank flags. You can get them at Colonial Flag. You can get them off of Amazon. For fairly cheap and you can decorate your own flag and have your own messages for the march on your car so the more flags or the more decor the better our parade will look so we are having a car decorating contest we will have prizes for the top five cars so if that motivates you you know get ready and uh, see how well you can decorate your car for life we are so excited to be able to see how you decorate your cars and so excited to be able to spread the message of life throughout the state of Utah and to be able to think of those unborn babies that are killed in Utah every year. We're so grateful to have you come. Don't forget, the merrier your car, the better our parade looks, and we're excited to see your ideas.